What's up, Pokemon fans? I'm Professor K for the Pokemon Evolutionaries, and joining me behind me is, once again, Professor A. Hey, everyone! So, today, we're going to be opening up a Premium Trainers XY Collection box. This is the box that has 14 different full arts in it. Blacksmith, 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 <laughs> Blacksmith, Blacksmith, Blacksmith. blacksmith. It it is a pretty cool card, not gonna lie. Uh, that was a lot more blacksmiths than I expected, though. <laughs> so, in here, we get all those full arts, plus we get two packs of cards. It is an expensive box. It does retail around 97 to uh, 95 to 100 dollars, depending on where you buy it from. So, it is an expensive box, but it comes with a lot of really cool stuff. And there's also a metal Pikachu coin inside as well. So, let's take a look at this thing. Right up front, we got our first four full arts in Team Flare Grunt, Shaman EX, and Yveltal EX. And on the back, look at that, the XY logo, all intertwined. Aww. But there's nothing for me to read. But there is. Oh, wait, but there is. <laughs> it's right here. All right. So this is actually on the bottom of the box, which is a little bit weird and a little bit awkward, but I'm going to make it work. Live large with a giant collection of premium cards with more than a dozen full art promo cards and an amazing assembly of accessories. The Pokemon Trainers XY Collection stands out as a player's paradise. Powerful, tournament-worthy Pokemon EX and trainer cards combined. Wow, it says combine with instead of combined. They're missing a D. Uh. <laughs> With a metal Pikachu coin and booster packs from the XY series to make the Premium Trainers XY collection an unbelievable upgrade to anyone's collection. So, in here, we do have uh, full art foil promos featuring Shaman EX, Yveltal EX with special art treatments, 12 more on top of that featuring Aegislash, Jirachi, and, and more. Two Pokemon uh, TCG booster packs from the XY series, metal coin featuring Pikachu, head and tail. Two sets of 65 sleeves featuring Xerneas and Yveltal. A double deck box featuring Xerneas and Yveltal. Two set of tournament ready dice, a code card for the Pokemon trading card game online, and a large kickstand style box to hold it all. I didn't know about the sleeves and the deck box and the dice. That's pretty neat, actually. And now you do. The more you know. All right, here we go. Let's get this thing opened up. Ah, wow, that was that was forceful. Very forceful. <laughs> oh my goodness! Wow, look at this thing, man. This thing is absolutely huge like just take that in for a second ah, all right take this out of here now, how do we get this thing actually slide open it, slide it. no 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 it's no not sliding oh. no it's magnetic oh my god my mind's freaking out now i already had my freaks earlier <laughs> it is magnetic that is actually really cool this is amazing now how do we get this off okay so this comes off of here like this one of those full arts just fell, and it's the N. <laughs> of course, it'd be N trying to escape first, right? Of course. So we're going to put that in its first sleeve, set that back there. We got the next one, which we've got Team Flare Grunt full art. This looks really nice. It's so awesome. I'm glad that these cards are getting full art treatments because they deserved it a long, long time ago. I agree. Shame and EX, it's alternate art, secret rare printing style even though it's just an alternate art. But it has been a staple for many years. It has, it has indeed. And then, boy, that last one. The other staple. Here we go. All right, Yveltal EX. And this card has been through a lot since I started playing the game especially. Yes. Very neat looking card there as well with Xerneas hanging out there in the background. All right, we'll set that back up there. This can go back to being closed. Now, let's start taking this thing out piece by piece. There's all that. You got the sleeves, the deck box, the two packs. I can't let you guys see this promo card because these promo cards, according to uh, a local source, are going for up to $15. So, I unfortunately will not be showing that one. Gonna well, be keeping that one. Plus, uh, we, we, we kind of want it. You know, our own selves. <laughs> for this, for streaming, yes. Yeah, that, makes that, our that's makes our cards look prettier. Yeah. Oh my goodness, they're actually like that too. That is so cool. Oh man, I can't wait for you guys to see this. This is amazing. All right, so here's the Pikachu coin that they talked about. This is metal. It's pretty heavy duty. Pikachu for the heads, and then of course the tail for tails. That's a neat looking coin right that there. Amazing. Oh, it's very very well detailed, and down to the last little. 
Oh man, so good. All right, next one we're gonna look at here is Mega Camera Up EX Full Art. So we're gonna put that in its matching not sleeve. I'm fully certain why the Full Art's for these. Full I'm not art. sure. I'm not sure either. There's Mega Sharpedo. Another alternate. Actually, this is a this is an alternate <laughs> alternate promo. That's super weird. X and Y 200A. What? All right. Cool. And then. This one's a little bit uh, out there. I wasn't expecting this one. Aegis Slash EX getting a full art. Um, it's really a good card, and it was a very good card and expanded a while back. Mighty Shield, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks from each of your opponent's Pokemon that has any special energy attached to it. To be fair, though, when Phantom Forces first came out, it was a staple and standard also. Yeah, that it was. Then we got Regirock EX, another card that has always deserved a full art in my mind, alongside of uh, Zygarde that got one recently. Uh, Reggie Powered, the uh, attacks of your fighting Pokemon do 10 more damage if there is a Reggie Rock on the bench. That's pretty cool. Set that back there. But of all things. Of all things art. to get a full art, yes. Stardust Jirachi XY67 alternate promo. Yeah, this is still legal, by the way. This is the very, very last uh, legal promo card that's in standard right now. XY67 was the cutoff. So this is barely legal. Wait. Oh, never mind. <laughs> so it's a full art. Doesn't have texture on it, but it still looks pretty nice. All right, moving on to the next section. We've got Shauna. This is a card that, again, I'm surprised it's taken this long to get us a full art of her. Long time. But there's your full art, Shauna. Then we've got the full art delinquent. Another card, very, very good. Definitely deserving of that full art treatment as well. Very nice. And then... Blacksmith, 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 Blacksmith. <laughs> Somebody is a Volcanion fan back here. For those of you who don't know, I love playing Volcanion decks. They are my go-to deck. And I almost got into top 128 with it at regionals, but that's besides the point. Yeah, that's true. Hex Maniac, another one. Very deserving of a full art. Very nice looking card. I wish that, they, that these full arts would have been made. That made. I wish some of these full arts would have been made into standard, as you know, actual promos. I agree with you on that one. And Karen, this is uh, another. This one kind of surprised me a little bit, but again, it is one of those supporters that didn't get a full art, so definitely cool. So there's your Karen full art, and that does it for all 14 of those. Also, we have the dice. So along the uh, X line, we've got our X dice there, and then we've got our Y dice here. So blue and red represent Xerneas and Yveltal, and each with their corresponding damage dice. There's six of each of these. There's the X and Y. Those, I believe, count for one. And then the rest of them, oh, yeah, they do. Look at this four. What the heck? What? It's missing a dot. It's like it didn't uh, get filled in. Awkward. Quality control at its best. I'll say it again. Very best. Yes, indeed. All right. And that is going to do it for the box itself for the... Uh, the uh, full art promos, the dice, the coin, and now we've got the sleeves. So there's our Yveltal sleeves, and there is our Xernia sleeves. So they're the same style that you get in like Elite Trainer boxes with the uh, silver. They do look really nice. That I do have to say. So there's those. And last but not least, before we get to the packs, our double deck box. There is Xerneas on the front and Yveltal on the back. So that's why this thing costs as much as it does. There's also dividers in here as well, inside of here. And there's their own deck holder boxes too that you can take out. I'm gonna leave mine sealed for now though. But it is really neat. Actually, you know what, no, I I'm getting another box. I'll leave that one sealed. I'll open this up so you guys can actually see it. I feel like that's only fair. Because I did get another one from a good buddy, Pokeballs, who has uh, started up his own store, Queen City Gaming. You guys should check it out. Ah that down there, and that from there, okay, get off my hand, <laughs> alright, so here, you got a place to put your name if you want to, it's magnetic, see, it does stick that way, then, as I said, here are your dividers, there's Xerneas on this side, Yveltal on the other, or actually, there's two Yveltal, one Xerneas, that's a little weird, where's the fourth one? No more in there? That is very weird, usually you get two of each, very strange, that is indeed, and then your two little deck boxes that come with it, that they sit uh, in there independently, one Xerneas, one Yveltal. 
with the Pokemon trading card game on the back. So they sit right in there. So you got a way to hold two decks when you go to tournaments. Very nice. Just weird that I didn't get four dividers. Product quantity. Yeah. And then the two packs we get here. We got the Primal Fish and Rayquaza. We got Primal Clash, Roaring Skies, two pretty cool sets to open up. So we're gonna get these things open up. And this is it for that box. Three and two for the X and Y pack trick. We've got Metatite. I always love that Metacham deck. Hone Edge, Trico, Tangela, Skitty, Rhydon, Maxi's Hidden Ball Trick, Weakness Policy, Reverse Hollows of Rhyperior, and a Starmie non hollow rare. Now on to our Roaring Skies pack. Three and two is the pack trick. We got a Cascoon. Inke, Voltorb, Spiro, Natu, Exeggutor, Dragonair, Healing Scarf, Reverse Hollow Ultra Ball, and a Togekiss Hollow. So we got one Hollow out of that as well. But we got 14 full arts though. Yeah. <laughs> you know what we got? What? Blacksmith. Blacksmith, yeah. Blacksmith. Of course. Of course. So all 14 of these are very, very nice looking. Um, if you're a player or just a collector in general, I think this is a really neat product. Um, I definitely think it's worth the money considering now that I know you also get sleeves, deck box, dice, all of that good stuff. But I'm just going to lift my camera up one time so you guys get a look at everything all in one spot. Those are all the cards that come inside. Very, very awesome stuff. So if you guys are looking to pick it up, now you guys know what's inside and you know what you're going to be purchasing if you do happen to pick one of these up. And, uh, well, I guess that's going to do it for today, guys. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys stay tuned. we got plenty more Crimson Invasion stuff coming out here real soon, as well as other stuff. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today. I'm Professor K for the Pokemon Evolutionaries. I'm Professor A. We'll see you guys next time. Take care. Have a great day.